All right, Catasaurus, let's see some crits. I, I, I brought you... Okay, thank you. I brought you in here for a reason, and you do it. You do it for the reason you're in here for, you know? Okay, good. How's our Savage Blow? I like it. Nice, good. Okay, cool. What about Wallet? Get tons of money from these, uh... These seals, that's nice. Since there's metal, Doge is in the beginning stage of this. I bet there's gonna be another metal enemy, is there? No. Okay. Interesting. Okay. This looks very SOL-ish, doesn't it? Not too bad, actually. With one row, this seems manageable, especially with Housewife. Housewife can reach really well here. The metal doges, though, are gonna be a little bit of a nuisance. But I think other than that, we're okay here. I think out of anything, Metal Doge is actually perfect. That's good, uh, that's good wave proc, not gonna lie. Very helpful wave proc. Screw, I don't even need Catasaurus anymore, man. Oh my god, the Savage Blow combos. Oh my god, the critical hits. Okay. Bro, this looks like a stage where you can legit just solo with Manic Eraser and Housewife. Oh my god. Let's just see how these two do, just alone. Okay, I think I'm gonna need some Catasauruses. They're gonna start pushing pretty hard here. Some can cans of the bonus would be pretty nice. Slime Cat, good wave. Very great. Okay, this is not that bad. This is pretty simple. Use Neobacco. That's only like a 50% chance crit, anyways. That's not really reliable to have Backhoe Cat for this. Yeah, it's like a surge, but that's still like only 15. Ow. What do y'all think about these types of packs that are super easy? What do y'all think about them? Y'all think they're boring, entertaining? They could be entertaining in the fact that they can be very chill. But at the same time, I feel like for me, it's personally just not as entertaining as like a difficult stage where I'm just struggling more. I think having more of a story of struggling would be more entertaining, but... If y'all like it, I I'm down to do more of these types of, like, chill stages. Because there really isn't much to really either, like, commentate about it or just really... Just really, just let, like, the auto CPU just really do its thing here. I don't know, man. They're, they're, I think they're fun to do, but not too often. That's the thing. The thing I'm having a problem with is, like, a lot of packs are like these. That's the problem, man. Like, SOL Plus is also, like, another breeze through. Like, I'm fine with having these types of packs, but, like, I still want to find some challenging packs, but not too challenging, you know? It's just really hard. That's the problem with these. They're hit or miss. Yeah, it really is like that. And then sometimes they just become this tedious. <laughs> like, they may be easy, but they're also quite tedious. As you can see here. It's, like, not a bad stage at all. This is actually a really well-designed stage. At least for restrictions, like, one row, but... It's still pretty damn easy. I don't know, man. Like, should I put more restrictions down? Like, restrict, like, talents or something? Maybe the talents is what is really the power creep here. I thought, like, more of, like, egg units and stuff and, like, UL true forms would be the power creep. Maybe what's, like, the true factor of power creep and making this stuff easy? Maybe just the talents. I don't know. But, uh, there goes Dangerous Detour. Hopefully, you're all enjoying these more simplistic stages. All right, here we go. Oh, my God, it's this thing again. I remember this thing, the, the zombie jellyfish. How, how how are you doing? It's been a little bit. Glad you're back. He looks pretty cool, doesn't he? He looks really cool. I, I like the jellyfish. Look at that. Let's zoom out a little bit. Look at that jellyfish. Really cool. I, I'm, I'm liking the custom uh, enemies so far. That's the only one we have seen so far, but... So far, just by seeing that first custom enemy, it's looking pretty damn cool. I like it. I like how it just kind of disappears, too, for the borrow. That's really cool. I forgot what he does again. Or what this thing does. This, Zombie Jellyfish. I think it just has some type of attack and just has some type of ability. It can also attack from behind, which is kind of cool. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Look how that's slow. Um, That's a little bit of a problem right there. But the enemy side here. Okay, there's that. Okay, I think the Star Ping is going to handle them. So we're going to so actually have to fight this thing. Maybe? Hacking, you got a good strike there. I like that. Okay, never mind. Yeah, you're going to be a problem. For sure. Okay. I'll swipe. No oh, savage blow. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Uh, but we are beating him down pretty easily. 
Yeah, bro, I wish, like I said, I wish these were more difficult. I wish we had, like, more interesting support. Because honestly, I have to say this. What kind of support is this for this enemy? What is this support? It's not that much support, honestly. I don't know, man. Is there really certain restrictions? Am I just playing this wrong? Am I, is there supposed to be a certain play style? Like, even with challenges, like one row, it's still so damn easy. I don't know, man. I don't know if it's meant to be this easy or it's just... Or it's just I'm supposed to be using, like, certain bigger restrictions. Like, if there was restrictions, though, they would, like, like, they would put it in the level, right? Like, that's the thing, man. Like, this, like, this is just too easy. Like, that's the problem. Like, honestly, all I can, you know, what I can do right now is just, like, speed it up CPU and just beat the stage right here, right now. Like, boom, that easy. Portuguese Caravel. That's the name. Is that the name of the jellyfish? Okay, that's cool. I, I'm not gonna remember that, but that's cool. Unfortunately, it just doesn't have that much, like, strong support. Like, I think it would fit with this, like... Like, if I had to make a stage with him... I think I would definitely probably add, like, maybe, like, a Lore Gravy slash Miss Haka combo. To keep you busy. Keep you busy. And to, like, protect him a little bit more. With maybe, like, Zom... Like, maybe with, like, the same peons as in here. Like, if we had, like, a Lore Gravy and a Miss Baka in here... Uh, this could definitely be more of a challenging and intriguing stage to do with one row. But, uh, GG's, we did it. Rokil has been defeated. It was pretty easy. So, okay, so we're playing one of the more later stages of the 10 times pack here. And, uh, so far it does look interesting, a little bit more challenging. Because I feel like, like, the earlier stages are too easy, man. Like, they're barely just giving, like, any support to any of these, like, enemies. And even if they are supported, uh, it's very easy support. And as you can see... Yeah, these are a little bit more difficult, man. These little boars, they're actually coming out a lot more frequently. Maybe I should just be playing more of the modern stages. I don't know. All right, seems like I cleaned out all the little boars that came out in the beginning here. So now we can actually fight this more realistically without boar, without many little boars coming out. That's going to be interesting. Oh, let's try it out here. See how this is going to go. Boom. There we go. Nice little bonk right there. Beautiful. I got pizza for the otters. Same with Can Can. That's going to help a lot. Oh my god, dude, we're finding so many Slepners today. I just noticed that. Another Slepner today. Oh my god, I'm just hoping Bullet Train is going to be enough for the Slepner here. And the Pizza Waves, which we're striking a lot of there. That was two in a row. That was very nice. Alright, I think it's definitely possible with one row. This definitely looks possible with one row. It's just going to be a little bit more challenging. And it's going to be a it's gonna be a good challenge, it seems. Bow, 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 this is a great challenge. Let's go, dude. All right. I love rhyming. love singing. Singing is fun. Very nice. Bigger pizza roll. That little pizza roll. Never heard of that before. For me, my my vocabulary is is like pizza pops and pizza pockets. Those are mine. I never eat, I never eat pizza rolls. Pizza rolls sounds like ugh. What the hell is pizza roll? This is nasty, bro. Damn. Banana, banana. Bagel bites are good too. Bagel bites. Those are nice. Those are recently back in stores. That's cool. Alright, now I guess it's just a tedious thing here. This gives me a lot of flashbacks to No Return Flight. Okay, we killed the Slepner. This reminds me of No Return Flights. With like the otters. It really does. But there we go. Look at that easy peasy. Even like, like look at that. Even like the modern stages are easy too. Like, I would expect, like, these to be extremely difficult with run roll, at least, when it comes to, like, this point of these stages, but no. God damn, man. That's so unfortunate. Why do they make these so easy? Like, I feel like they should be a lot more difficult, well test played, and good to go. I think that's a problem with, like, longer pack stages just in general. It's just the fact that they are just... A lot more easier because maybe they just don't have the time to test play it and they're too scared to make it too hard maybe that might be what it is 